Hey, hello and welcome once again. Uh, thanks for watching my videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you the best way to export picture, to save your picture at JPEG, uh, to get the complete colors in your pictures. So avoid your pictures from being compressed uh, while posting it on social media. So if you want to know how I get this outcome of this picture, you can watch the previous video. This is the before the picture and this is the after of the picture so we all we did is change the color of the picture so if you want to know how I do that watch my previous video I just dropped that also so the best way to save picture many people do save as just just control shift x let's try that out and see control shift s then save as jpeg just click here save as jpeg some people do save as png which is nice too but the best way to save a picture is for we to export it and to do that what are we going to do we're going to go to file then go to export and i'm not some people do save direct as a png which is nice also save for web which is nice also but the best way for we to save our studio picture is to export as then we wait for the panel to load up then we do the appropriate settings for uh, our picture then we export it straight up So this is what our panel, our export panel looks like here. This is the picture we are trying to export. It's on JPEG now. You can try to save it as PNG, but I saved my picture as JPEG, and it was 100% quality also. Here's the image size, scale 100%, 100%, scale 100%, for example, by cubic or two. You can try to change it to maybe you want the picture to be sharper, to be smoother. I don't, and also there are other options there for you to choose on. Uh, sometimes I do choose sharper, sometimes I choose smoother. So let's go with sharper now to make our image a little bit more sharp. So click on sharper now, and I'll jump straight to color profile. So color profile, I'm going to click on it. This is going to measure our colors together for us while exporting the picture. Uh, sometimes you you notice when you save a picture, uh, the different the, the, the different color it will display on Photoshop. And the different color is going to display on your maybe your mobile phone or even in your file manager also so the reason is that the color are not embedded together the, all the color profiles are not embedded together so once you click on this it's going to do the job for you then you are going to click on your export your export straight up then you take it to your file manager where you are going to save your picture the name you want to save it to it or any other thing you want to save it with there So you can try to save with any name you want to save with it and you can try to choose your location from here i love saving my pictures on desktop it gave me as easy access so model okay now click on my save wait for it to save the picture for me So it has done the job for us, so that's all for today's tutorial, thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel and also turn on the notification icon, if you have any question you can drop your question in the comment section below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible.